Home Link 512, Writing Fraction Multiplication Stories. Solve each multiplication problem, then write a number story that matches the number sentence in the representation. So the example is 1 fourth times 5 sixth, which equals 5 twenty-fourths. You can see the 5 right here that are shaded darker than the rest out of the 24. If I take my, change my marker so I have 1 fourth, so it's split into fourths, here would be my 1 fourth, and I'm going to switch colors, and now I have 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So the five down at the bottom that are both orange and red are your numerator, and then we had 24 total. The number story is Miss, Mr. Danielson had a tray of pumpkin bread that was five six full. After sharing his bread with students, one-fourth of what he had brought was left. What fraction of the whole tray was left? So now, you have 4 times 2 thirds equals. So, first, solve. So, I know I can change, I'm going to write on the right hand side, it can be 4 over 1 times 2 thirds. So, 4 times 2 is 8, and 1 times 3 is 3. So, I have 8 thirds. <coughs> Or, 3 goes into 8 two times, which leaves me 6. 8 minus 6 equals 2. So I have 2 thirds left. So it asked for, now you need to write the number story. So, do I have 8 thirds left? 1 third, 2 thirds, 3 thirds, 4 thirds, 5 thirds, 6 thirds, 7 thirds, 8 thirds. And you could combine them together to get two holes with two-thirds left over. Here could be our here could be our story. Our class ordered four types of cookies. We ate two thirds. How much? How many? How many cookies did we eat? So the number two, you have one half times sixteen. You need to solve and give a number story. Down at the bottom, the practice says make an estimate, then add or subtract. Show your work on the back of this page. I'm highlighting that. Show your work on the back of this page. I know that we usually have work on the back, so you need to show your work elsewhere. So first estimate, then solve. Just 